<laughs> Let's get started with a practical exercise. Here's the script for one scene taken from a whole story. Read it, then we'll examine it together. It's a page and a quarter, so it would take about 75 seconds on screen. At 10 seconds a shot, we'd expect to have eight or more shots. Do you think it's dull, boring, flat, not dramatic? What don't you fully understand? Your job as director is to make it dramatic and involve the audience. For now, don't change the script. Let's start making sense of the scene. Pause the video and find your own answers to the questions on the right hand side. Make at least three answers to each question. When you're ready, continue with the video. Your responses were certainly different from mine. In a real directing situation, that's good. It adds richness to the video from the very beginning. Let's take the questions one at a time. I came up with four responses. Take a moment to read them. Yours were different. I don't know what they were, so we'll have to work with mine. What does the scene contribute to the narrative? Do you notice how the director's narrative affects his responses? The narratives and responses could be combined in various ways. Other narratives like a whodunit or a comedy are possible. Thank you. 
facts do we know before the scene starts? The scene's coming alive for me. I can see the characters and how they work together. Let's look at the scene more deeply. The emotional event is what you want the audience to feel. It's the dynamic, emotional transaction that the shots will tell. In a real situation, we discuss our ideas and move forward enriched. These are my suggestions. Next, think about each character. These questions follow from each other and get more specific. What's the character's need throughout this scene? What's the character's objective in order to meet that need? And what does the character do to reach that objective? If you like, you can decide whether the character wins or loses, meets the objective or not. Start with Guy. Here's the script again with the questions on the side to remind you. Here's how I saw Guy. Now focus on Jasmine. What's going on with her? <laughs> Thank you. 
Here's how I saw Jasmine. And now Basil. And now Basil. There's one other important player in the scene, the set. What can we pull out of the script about the set? What will the audience expect to see or hear? The set has a character, a look, a feel that helps the audience understand the scene. Ask yourself these questions and perhaps others. How can the set help tell the story? These were my thoughts on the set. The next step might be a sketch, perhaps by the director or by the set designer, depends on the budget. The action unfolds in definite steps. Technically, they're known as beats. These are the beats I pulled out of the set. Each one is a change of topic. Each one is started by Guy. That showed me Guy dominates and firmly controls the discussion. It was a bit of a surprise to me, but perhaps it shouldn't have been. Now I had a good feel for the scene and you're getting the idea of how the director thinks and works. Good directors don't wing it or rely on gut instinct. They work hard on those gut feelings. They work with their writers and production teams. Then I moved on to design my shots. Yeah. 